Why am I awake? I have a rope drop park opening parade, not parade, crowd control shift this morning. Did I mention it's 10 hours long? I'm gonna see if I can get out early, at least by two hours, because I feel like I'm going to drive myself crazy considering I have to start at 6.30 and the first march or parade doesn't even start until 10. What am I gonna do for four hours? Literally, it's been forever since I've worked a night shift, so I haven't been to the cast parking lot, let alone a park parking lot at night in a very long time. So I'm like, what is this? Like literally I was like, am I going for another race? Am I running again? <laughs> so I can't film too much because the cleaning crew is around cleaning things. But I'm getting to see all of the Christmas lights for the first time and it makes me really happy. Worth it. As soon as I get settled in the break room, I'll sneak out to the frozen pretty sure area and get a picture of the uh, Christmas tree if I can. There's lights around our fast pass queue. And then look at the tree. It's so pretty. Today wasn't horrible. Uh, pack shifts are always interesting because it's a lot of stress in like one concentrated time period and then like literally just keeping yourself entertained for like the next, until the next show comes around. Um, today, um, hi, yeah, I am totally driving, thanks. You're a transportation cast member. You are a transportation cast member going the wrong way and I almost hit you. Unacceptable. <laughs> anyway. Like literally, I swear that people think it's Christmas. It is that busy. We have been so busy. There have been so many people. And the fact that they're still doing um, major concrete work uh, on <laughs> the road looks so bad because they're getting ready to change it in a couple of days. Like literally these road signs are just all over the place. Um, we're just so busy and there's very little space in center stage because of all the concrete work going on and we're just a construction site and there's just things that are open, things that are closed because th certain things are changing and it's just all freaking all over the place and it's, 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 it's been, it's gonna, it's, it's, it's uh. anywho, I did get out early, um, I started at 6.30 and I was talking about earlier how I was like, I don't know what I'm gonna be doing. Basically, what well, I forgot that Hollywood Studios did this. They have a, it's a paid extra magic hours, basically. Extra morning hours. What they do is ABC Commissary is open for breakfast. All you can eat breakfast. And then they open Toy Story Land. And so that select people who pay, I don't even know how much they're paying, but they'll select the people that pay the extra money for it. They get to go and eat at ABC Commissary. I think it's from like seven to 10, which isn't bad especially if you, you keep going back and then you can go to Toy Story but literally that's the only things that open that are open is Toy Story Land and then you get to eat, it's an all-you-can-eat buffet ABC commissary and we let in the rest of the guests around 9 I want to say so I mean that so that's basically what I we did we went in and we made sure everything was set up and good which it was not set up and good they were still uh, finishing paving a very large area so that we had to re rope off uh, they held them of course uh, at the front uh, at around like nine ish and then that's when that's when literally a full sea of people it's like a huge parade type of a thing they all come like walking down that way and I am just like I was glad that I was over um, I was over by Great Mover Ride making sure that they were going the right way in case anyone trickled away from the herd but like it was insane and it was super foggy this morning too so it reminded me of um, like a, 
I said it reminded me of from episode one of Star Wars where the Gungans and the droids are getting ready to battle and like um, the general looks over at Jar Jar and goes ouch time <laughs> like it reminded me of that like an army coming towards us but like other than that we did that and then kind of reset up but like other than that like other the we have the marches so we clear the area for that and it's just answering questions trading pins with people giving directions and that's like it that's it there's like nothing else that we really do because the stage show isn't up so that's gonna be my life for the next four days three days three days Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Three days. Thank God. <laughs> and I start at 9.30 instead of 6.30. So there's that. But anyway, I'm going to go home and try to get some chores done. Because I have been putting off cleaning up after setting up for Christmas. My office looks awful. That and I haven't even set up for my office. Like, I haven't set up any of my Christmas decorations in my office. So got to figure out that as well. So that's what I'm going to do when I get home. <laughs> she look at Jared, look at her. She literally came over to sit right next to me. She's taking your spot. Jared's not over here looking at me. Eat. <laughs> she's, she's she's watching you eat. <laughs> Fuzzy kitty. Silly girl. You're silly.